All right, guys, tonight we are going to do something that I have been putting off this whole Christmas season, and that is we are going to put up our Nightmare Before Christmas tree, our Halloween Christmas tree, and not only a Halloween Christmas tree, but this is going to be a Spirit Halloween Christmas tree. I have boxes and boxes of these figural bag clips from Spirit Halloween. And tonight, after we get the tree set up, we're going to start decorating it with Spirit Halloween Series 1 and Series 2 bag clips. We have some other ones mixed in here, like the Universal Monsters. And then in my office there, we have even more. We have about five more boxes, if not six, maybe even seven or eight more boxes, because I have bought a ton of these things, and we're going to use them to decorate our tree. So the first thing we need to do is get the tree out of this box. This is actually a pre-lit tree. I know my head's cut off there in the video. <laughs> that you basically put together and then unfold. We have four of these pieces here. Those go on the base. They all just click right into place. And then we are ready to get started. That'll be perfect right there. So the first thing we gotta do is unfold all these branches here. You gotta fluff these branches up a little bit. And the next layer goes on. That plugs in. Unfold all these branches, fluff them out a little bit, and put the top on. All right, that's coming together pretty good. I don't know what we're going to use for our tree topper. All right, there we go. That's not too shabby. I like how it's right in the corner over there. We got our tree skirt here. I chose the black and white checkered because it reminds me of Nightmare Before Christmas. Not too bad. So last year, as a tree topper, we had Ghostface up there, if you remember. This year, we're going to see if we can get Crouchy up there to be our tree topper. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, that is just too funny. Crouchy as our tree topper. Look at him just sitting there watching over. All right, let's go ahead and dive into our bag clips here. Let's start with hugs. We got hugs right here, front and center. Let's go ahead and put him on the tree somewhere just to kick this whole thing off. How about right here? We're just going to slide that right over the branch there. Let's lift the branch up a little bit. And there is hugs. The first animatronic keychain on our tree all right let's go ahead and grab whoever's next here we got dracula put him right over here crunchy bones miserable marie we'll put her right up here by crouchy Ooh, i see uncle charlie here let's get him on the tree next let's put him down here on this one here we go these are really weak branches so you gotta lift them back up but there he is all right let's see we got frankenstein put him right here Pumpkin Nester, you can go right there, sir. We got the Mummy, you will do well right here. Who's this? Oh, the Hauntress. How about right here for the Hauntress? All right. I see Crouchy in here. Since we got a big Crouchy on top, let's go ahead and put him on a lower branch here. There you go. Bloody Bag of Jokes. How about right here? Oh, we got the Bride of Frankenstein here. There. Right there by the mummy. Lil Skelly Bones. About right here in the front. Those are looking pretty cool so far. All right, we got the Roaming Antique Doll. I think we need one right here. Who's this? Phantom of the Opera. Put him up here by Crouchy. Let's go into series two here. We'll do the graveyard ghoul. About right here under hugs. All right, zombie swing girl. That'll work right there. Cerberus, the three-headed dog. He's kind of heavy, so he's got to be on a strong branch. We'll put him up here so he can rest on that one right there. All right, let's see. We got the pumpkin harvester. Is that what his name is? Pumpkin harvester? I think so. Let's put him on a lower branch here. There we go. All right, let's see. We got a bunch of exclusives in the Series 2, which actually belong to Series 1. So we'll put those on at some point, but let's do Silent and Deadly. We'll put him on a lower branch here, too. There we go. The Collector. That'll be good right there. 
Grave Watcher. Put her down here by Silent and Deadly. Here we go, Barnyard Butcher. Let's put him over here by Frankenstein. Yep. Yeah, that is coming along pretty good, guys. But I decided to go ahead and bring out the Nightmare Before Christmas bag clips because it's technically a Nightmare Before Christmas tree. So I got Zero here. Look at this. He's got a little candy cane in his mouth. Let's put him over here. We got the Pumpkin King here. Put him down on the bottom here. He can ride on that branch. We got Oogie Boogie. Let's put him in this bare spot here. We got the pink Happy Easter Bunny. Let's hang him right on the side here. There we go. Jack Skellington. This looks like a good spot. Oh my gosh, I forgot how many pink bunnies we got. One, two, three, four. We got five pink bunnies when we opened these. That is looking pretty good over there. I think we need some things under the tree though how about this guy yeah right there is perfect <laughs> that is awesome guys i think we need some chains of death how about a cat dog this guy right here peeking out how about handstand larry right in the front here and little miss throwing a fit right about here let's put scabs down here there we go move that guy over a little bit and we'll put carrot right on the other side right about there and we'll finish it off with a secret keeping cat right on top of the pumpkin here now that is one awesome, spooky, nightmare before Christmas tree. I love everything about this. This looks so cool and Halloween-y. We got the chains of death on there. And to top it off, Crouchy. Looks even better with the lights out.